I don't know. It's a good game, but I just don't, I'm not sure. I know the guy we have with the chain gun looks new. But I'm not sure why K9 wasn't going for the flags or stopping the people who had the flags. I'm not sure what's the point. Isn't it to win? <laughs> So was, it's a little weird. I didn't understand what was going on. It was a bit weird. I was a bit confused like what was happening. This build is decent though. I'm, I'm starting to understand the flat cannon. I'd, I'd love I'd love to get some um, I'd love to be able to get some mods for these things. That's why I said, like, I wish there was a way you could target mods. Like, you want to buy, get mods for specific things. Even if it was uncommon, it'd still be better to have some kind of mod versus nothing. Oh, okay. Yeah, I wasn't sure, because I can't see them. Like, that's the weird thing that we don't have shared vision in this game. Like, that was the one thing I think Ving... VG, Vainglory always had that was nice. Um, vision was a thing. Like, um, if your player could see it, you could see it. Like, your teammate could see it, you could see it. Um, it kind of helped. So, it's kind of weird that even when your players are around stuff, sometimes you can't see what's going on. So, you're just like, what the hell's going on? Why is he moving? So, yeah, I was, I was a little confused. Oh, why is Valor Mines not upgraded too? Yeah, I don't have to worry about that. Yeah, when I get things under 400 for sure, I'm, I'm pushing them. With all this dust, yeah, for sure. And I think when I get my level, when I get my stuff that's um near level 20, near 1,000 away, yeah, I'm just dusting those up too. Like, there's no point in, in delaying it. Like I said, now there's something to get. How did it only go up one level? I just leveled something up like crazy. Hmm. I can't tell what this trinket is doing. Oh, I have to dodge. I didn't know that. Let me try that again. Let me try it in Slayer. It might be easier to see. There's way more people around when you're playing that. Victorious. We have advanced our position. Your opponent has taken Coward ground. or not, fight back. so close bro then I was like oh, I'm gonna get oh I don't have any more bullets <laughs> Wild Slinger, this is the side you needed to be on? He's a junk.
Oh, we won? <laughs> when it's like, well, I was like, what the hell? <laughs> oh my God, that was stupid. I was just so silly. <laughs> I had no idea. I'm just like, I'm just like, yo, we ain't winning this game, but man, I'm gonna get as many kills as I can before we lose. <laughs> Holy crap! That was, oh, that was crazy. I did not expect that to work. Wow. Yeah, now Slayer is fun now. Eventide is really fun, it's just Eventide is also really long. <laughs> and I don't think this build was really good in Eventide. Well, I didn't I couldn't use it when I first started playing. Man, I do love that speed boost. I did not realize how much this was missing in my life until I have it. It's actually a really nice um totem. A setback indeed. Yeah, if I can't start shooting, I can't really stop him. <laughs> I was like, I couldn't figure out what just happened. You know what it is? It's because of his wing sweep. I can't tell what just happened. Teammates, they, they covered me because that wasn't on me. My Mauser doesn't outrange the chain gun at all, it's actually one of the shorter range weapons. Its explosion gets you close to it, but I don't even think you reach 10 with the explosive field because I think it's 7.6 and the explosions are like 2. Point something. So I don't think you ever, I don't think you outrange the miser, at, I mean the thing at all. Well, if you add it together, no, nope, yep, it outranges it by just the slightest. It's, it's a, it's actually, um, 10.3. Chain gun is exactly 10. Um, if he's not spun up, or if he has crazy low health, I can kill him. If I haven't started shooting and he's spun up, and I'm trying to turn around to start the miser damage, it ain't it ain't doing a damn thing. But think about what the miser does. The miser is doing 511 per shot. It only needs to release 14. So at 10, I'm going to do about 10,000. Once my temp shot goes off, I already did 5,000 damage on you. While you're regenerating health, though, I might be able to beat you. 
but I need a little bit of range. If I'm dead even and dead close to you and you're full health and I'm not, now nah, I don't think the miser will win. Because he beat me a couple of times. What I'm trying to do is using Wind Walker to run away and then turn around and shoot you. and Or if you're running away, close down. And what I try to do is use my sincerity inside the mix. The sincerity is like kind of the gun that I like. I, I, I still don't understand the reduction of its health. Because it's weird. Support has low health. Primal Hunter has low health. Sniper has low health. Assassin has low health. And only protection. And maybe a little bit of Vanguard has decent health. And some Primalist builds. But most... I like I think it's like three out of the four three out of the nine builds have decent healths that you can get if you don't mix in something like a vanguard or protection into it you're screwed but yeah like most of these things they have no way of um, surviving encounters with humans if you're not like really really far away it's really strange it's very very strange to me Actually, I haven't even tried this. I haven't tried that at all. Let me try Mutiny Song with Tetrad, which is something I've learned before. Or Mutiny Song with Code of Fusion Constant. Because Code of Fusion Constant is kind of short ranged anyway. Um, let's go. Ability. Link Strike, I haven't played that in a hot minute. Wait, it's Ranger, right? Oh, Tetrad is Ranger, so we go Volatile Mind. And Trinket. Assassin. I should get a Bing of the Bear. We'll go the wraps. So this whole loadout. Oh, I got two. Two two and two. So it's a primalist assassin. Wait, that was weird. <laughs> it doesn't even make sense what I picked. I thought I was playing the Tetrad, duh. Actually, let me put the Tetrad up. Let me put the Tetrad up. Tetrad has really good range. Let me try that. This is kind of a running build. Yeah, this doesn't look very good. <laughs> Go and take what's yours. Okay. Dang it, I went the wrong way. Find the next one. So God, that's just the worst. <laughs> you can't explode them. You gotta come to them if you wanna if you wanna if you wanna do anything, you gotta come to them. You can't you can't get near. You will explode if you touch them. Then you can't get flag. near. <laughs> <laughs> that 
That's the best. <laughs> That's the best. <laughs> Undaunted strength. <laughs> we must regroup. That's messed up when you can't come in because there's a bunch of bottle mines in the area where you want to run to. <laughs> come on, just make the stupid roll. Where do you think I'm trying to go? Come on, man. It's like so stupid. supposed to do? I'll take that. Why not? I'm willing. But why is... Please go forward. Double kill. Yep. <laughs> drop them cheaply. I drop them in spots in front of you, so you see them. We just got to decide if you have to run into them or not. I don't, I don't do it cheaply. <laughs> well done. We have grown in strength. The way to victory. Man, but that's how I use concussive mines too. It's just bottom of mines are worse. They do more damage and I can drop them faster. <laughs> and I have no idea why people don't play them like that. You you literally can stop people from getting where they want to go because you just put a minefield in front of them that they cannot explode unless they run across or have something run across them. Why wouldn't you do that all the time? Like, that's how you would play Volatile Minds. Why wouldn't you play them like this? Everybody wants to do the quick kill. I'm going to drop like 16,000 on somebody. Oh, I blew them up. Oh, I killed them. But that's so effective. We were losing 3-0. The first time he could not even get to the, the freaking flag because he died running into mines. <laughs> Letting us score two points like real quick back to back. It's a perfect defensive posture i don't know to me it's a super like i don't even understand how volatile minds are ranger and not support it's like that's a support item straight up and down if not so, so it's still support i can't even see how it's vanguard or anything else but support that's a true support item so it's it's crazy to me man i i don't i don't get it <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Yeah, I'm gonna play it with the miser because I get the support bonus. And sincerity because I get the support bonus also. And then I'm gonna use Bracelet of the Firstborn. So here's what's gonna be funny. I believe it gets the it becomes infinite once you triple once you triple what do you call it? Um and if I get a tinkerer, it's worse because but my bracelet of the firstborn also has a tinker on it. So yeah, it should be it should be even faster. I should be able to drop mine every few seconds. Like second after second after second, just keep dropping mine. I should be able to cover a whole area just full of mines. That's why I say honestly, the Vado mines need to have a longer cooldown. So that can't actually be done. But it can be. Like even six seconds is still better than four. <laughs> it, it really is. Ooh, it's got a tactical on it. So this has an efficiency, which gives the the primary more damage, a tinkerer, to reduce the cooldown ability cooldown even further. And I'm gonna run triple primalist. I mean triple, <laughs> man, triple support. So if we look at the stats. I need one more gun. Something's off. I didn't equip you, did I? There you go. We're at 28. 28 plus 6. We're at 34.5. Um, if you look at full, the full version, it's 35. I'm 0.5 away from full support. Without, and I don't have a support item. So 30% off. Like if I get a legendary um a legendary cooldown, the cooldown will be zero on Volatile Minds. Or even an epic cooldown. It'll be damn near zero. If I get an epic cooldown, it'll be forty percent. And charge time right now is already one point eight. I mean four point eight. So if you take thirty percent off, not even counting point four. 4.4 that's supposed to be about a second this drops down to around three seconds 0.2 yeah this is gonna be about two seconds every two seconds I can drop three mines so let's see imagine when I have mods for those things Claim their flag. One, two, Defend three. your own. One, two, three. Yeah, I can drop a lot of mines. In. Mines everywhere. It's not fair, but it's the way this works. This is 
is the path to power. Defy them. Pick him up. He just can't. <laughs> A reckoning. He literally cannot pick up the flag. We have taken their flag. This is the correct path. Continue. Like he would have to transform into a primal to take the hit and then get the flag. But he cannot run into the flag as a human. I have too many mines there. He will take that much damage to come through. They have taken our flag. Not bad. He has a good health bar. He took only about 3,000. Cower not in the face of trial. We have recovered our flag. Double kill. That flag is ours. Take it back. Defy them. It should be. Well done. We have grown in strength. The way to victory. Yeah, it's... Even if... I just think they gotta increase it. The reason is, it's still too fast. Like... I just dropped it down to support. I actually seen somebody did it when they had when they have mods on top of it that brought it down to almost zero. Every time they drop mines, they there was oh it was infinite. They literally had infinite mines. That's what I'm saying. If I start getting if I get a, a, a rare or epic tinkerer on that, I can literally drop mines almost mines almost effectively forever. So yeah, it's it needs to go higher. Just logically, it needs to go higher. It just it needs to go higher a little bit. Yeah, I'm gonna drop off. I've been on for. I actually wanted to stop at two hours. It's going on like three. So this might be it for today. I may not stream again. 
but yeah, man, thanks for being on as usual, Sidrome. Um, Broken Valhalla, Dusty, all the, all the dudes who dropped in, I appreciate it. Um, so I'm gonna end the stream here, but yeah, man, I'm really liking, um, I'm really liking this update. It's a lot funner to play. Um, whether, and a lot more people are playing right now. Definitely a lot more people are playing. This is the most I've seen consist consecutively um, since. Like, we're at 18 people on my friends list. My friends list usually has three or four people on it. And I'm talking about I'm in both. Yeah, you have a good one, too. But like I said, um, it was Roy, Roy who said, like, oh, can you stream? If people ask, I will. But I'm not streaming... I'm like, I just don't stream as much. Like, the stream that I usually do now is just a Wednesday stream. That's the one I, I, I have set in my mind that I'm going to do for sure. So, but, yeah. Have a good one, y'all. So, keep your eyes, your ears, your hearts, and your mind open. And later.